now we are supposed to write a program in order to print this pattern so consider n representing your total number of rows so let us say user enters the value of n as 5 so if you observe there are total of 5 rows 3 4 5 and 5 columns as well so column 1 column 2 column 3 column 4 and here fifth column so if you observe this pattern carefully this is your row 1 and this is your column 1 if you add this so consider that these rows are represented by this variable i and this column numbers represented by variable j right so if you add this i and j together so consider this this instance that is your row 1 and column 1 so 1 plus 1 is 2 so in that case print 1 so if it is 2 then print 1 so 2 is an even number right now come to the next row row number 2 column number 1 so 2 plus 1 is 3 3 is odd so when you have odd the sum of this i and j is odd in that case i will be printing 0 now consider row number 2 and column 2 2 plus 2 is 4 and we know this time i plus j is even so in that case print 1 so whenever so the trend is here whenever the sum of this i plus j is even in that case i am supposed to print 1 and when the sum of this i plus j that is i and j is odd in that case i am supposed to print 0 so very simple idea let's convert this idea into code so everything is around this i plus j right so let me write the loop here that is for int i starting from 1 and i will go till n because there are n number of rows so here your i is used for representing the total number of rows right and here you know the purpose of i loop so this is just for just used for changing the lines now here i will be starting the loop j and j will start from 1 initial value of j from 1 and j will go till i why because if you observe this first row when i is 1 1 character is printed i is 2 2 characters are printed similarly if i is n then n number of characters are printed right so that's why j will start from 1 and j will go till i and here the variable j will increment by 1 now i'll write the condition here if the sum of i plus j that is sum of ith row and jth column if this is even how do we check a number is even or odd how do we check that we use this modular operator if i divide the number by 2 and the remainder is 0 in that case the number is even so in that case i'm supposed to print what so whenever the sum of this i plus j is even in that case i'm supposed to print 1 so i'll print 1 along with space clear else so when we will enter this else part when the number is odd obviously so here standard c out i'll be printing the value of 0 along with spaces okay so now let me compile this one so i'll just go to the desktop make test and there is no error so let me run it let me enter the value of ns5 so you can see the output that we are expecting is printed exactly here so whenever the sum of i plus j is even in that case print 1 otherwise print 0 so let me run this program for larger inputs so let me enter here 20 so you can see the very large right angle triangle filled with ones and zeros alternatively okay so i hope this program is clear and you have understood the idea that how can we play with this row number and column number in order to obtain patterns like this okay